Hey everyone, this is um, a question that might be on your AP exam, but it's basically a pre-cal type question. So basically when you have a square root in a function, the domain will require that the expression under the radical or the radicand not be negative. So we, it can be zero, but it just can't be negative. So we're going to take this expression, 4 minus x squared, and see what would make it positive or equal to zero. So I'm going to have um, add x squared to both sides. And then when I take the square root, um, basically what I could do is just factor this. Or you could take the square root of both sides. So you get plus or minus square root of uh, 4 is 2 is greater than or equal to x, or you could say x is less than or equal to plus or minus 2. So basically, um, because the radicand is allowed to be 0, we have the endpoints being, um, if you do a number line, we have negative 2 to 2, and if you plug in some values, we want it to be positive or zero. If I plug in zero, that's going to be positive. Um, if I plug in negative three, that's going to be negative. We can't have that. If I plug in three, that's also going to be negative. So this is negative. This will be positive, And this will be negative. So we it can equal negative two. So the, our solution set is going to be negative two is less than or equal to x, is less than or equal to 2. So basically just plug in some values and do it that way if you want. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.